Hi everyone and happy Tuesday. Uh, I'm sure some of you now are starting to get your DM32X gauges delivered to you. Uh, so congrats, I'm sure you're really gonna enjoy this gauge once you uh, start digging into it. So um, this week what I wanna show you how to do is how to update the gauge as we have uh, bug fixes, improvements, uh, new features, uh, things like that uh, for the gauge. So I wanna make sure that you know how to uh, have the latest version of, of all the apps that live on the gauge. So the first thing that I wanna do uh, once I have the gauge in my hand is make sure that I'm connected to the internet. So usually this is something that you're going to want to do when you're at your office or at home or maybe if you have your gauge tethered uh, to the Wi-Fi coming off of your phone. But uh, either way, you just want to be connected to the Wi-Fi um, somehow so that you have access to the internet on the gauge. So uh, the way I do that on the DM32X is if I'm on this home screen here, I can just swipe down from the top and that first option there says internet. So that's how I connect to the Wi-Fi. So here, if I click on it, uh, it's gonna look for uh, possible uh, Wi-Fi uh, connections there that I can connect to. Um, and it says that I am connected. Uh, you can see my network name is Cooley Lives Here, which is appropriately named because Cooley lives here. We can see that I'm connected, so I can just hit done. And then I can just swipe back up to get out of that. And then, uh, of course, up in the upper right hand corner here, I can see the little icon for Wi-Fi to show that I am connected. Um, so once I'm connected, I can then access the R store. Uh, and that's the place on the gauge where you can go and check for updates. So I get to the R store by uh, swiping up from the bottom of the screen. And here I can see a list of apps that uh, live in this area of the gauge. And the R store is the one here that looks like a little shopping cart with the DM32X in it. So I can go ahead and tap on that and it will open up. And now once the app opens up, uh, it'll start looking for updates. Uh, so here it looks like I have everything up to date. Uh, the DM32X gauge app, uh, the DM32X services, uh, rCloud, which is our automated testing app that now lives natively here on the gauge, as well as our resources app, which is where all of our uh, manuals, quick guides, and training videos are stored, and the R Store app itself. So if I had any updates, they would be here at the top of this list, and I could either update them individually or just uh, select Update All uh, to update all the apps at once. Uh, and then I would see a little status bar uh, that would go across the top to let me know uh, what percent that app is downloaded. So um, that's just the quick and dirty of how to uh, get to the R Store app on the DM32X and check for updates. So um, if you're not already uh, following us on Instagram, Facebook, or LinkedIn, um, if we have any major announcements for uh, new feature updates or um, new improvements or anything like that, we'll be sure to make an announcement. And of course, we have our quarterly newsletter that gets emailed out uh, each quarter. So. Um, you can uh, subscribe to that as well. Um, we do it quarterly because we know you have tons of emails that come into your inbox already, so we don't wanna be a part of that problem, but we do wanna kinda keep you in the loop as important things develop, uh, including you know, new training events or educational opportunities that we offer or new products. So um, feel free to uh, subscribe to that as well. You can do that on our website. Aside from staying in the loop that way, of course, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at any time. We're always happy to help, and thanks again for watching.